What's going on guys and welcome back to another anime fight fighter simulator uh, video today and in today's video we're going to be explaining the new summer island personally i think it's kind of an L of an update because it's not it's just the same to be honest the divine is worse the secrets are cool if you want to clone them the only i think the only major good thing about this update is that the, there is a new passive and i have seen apparently it does like um certain amount of damage attack speed and it's just a better general to be honest i'll put it up at the top right now what it does but yeah overall this update is kind of it's just kind of mid because like you can't you can't level up these units in the incubator so it takes a very long time to kill the boss up there all you have to do is slap on a shiny potion keep buying and selling buying and sell buying and sell once you get enough um like for example if i show you now if i open i get 94 sell but obviously you need to have the potion on so if i put a potion on go to this uh go to art sell everything is on open and you get 2.2k and literally all you want to do is fuse and boom that's literally the whole update apart from this new passive machine that's so so in my opinion they should have just kept the old summer and just brought out a new passive and maybe bring out something else while we're waiting i uh personally think like right now the game is just at a state where it's only fun if you like believe it or not it's only fun if you haven't hit uh the last island because i don't know i don't know about you guys that's obviously my opinion but i personally think grinding up the places with the shiny pot on getting new secrets getting new divines is fun but when when the divine and the secret are just not good it just makes it just it's not worth it maybe if they do buff the divine it might be worth like summoning for but to be honest don't i don't think it's worth summoning for the thing you should be doing though is farming the uh crew leader you want to be farming this for one unit you only want it on one one unit for example you just put on a double protagonist um divine and then you'll pretty much get on the leaderboards if you just have a whole list of like gods divines double protagonist so yeah um i know it's a quick video because i just want to get it out there that this event is just it's just not as fun as the uh infinite tower one was i don't know if you, about you guys but when the infinite tower one first came out i was playing it and i got so much resources off it but yeah this is nothing to be hyped over to be honest i mean obviously you guys will probably have a different opinion to me depending on what what you like you play in um how you want to play the game but like right now i'm just all all i'm doing is just afk and sitting here i'm not even afk and opening because like i need to grind for the i need to grind for my um duplication machine so obviously i've got 20 x so that overnight over overnight i get an instant it like instantly does but yeah um so i hope you guys do enjoy but i do want to say one thing if you guys could comment down below what games you would like to see me play for any like any robots games for example like blocks roots um anime adventures uh anime fighting sim x i really have been enjoying uh anime fighting sim x and anime adventures I'm gonna release a new video out. Um, I think maybe tonight or tomorrow. Uh, it's gonna be 24 hours grinding the new event. Well, not the new event, but the summer event to try and get all their units. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, thanks for watching. Just a quick one, and bye.